Yes, mate, welcome back to the channel. And in this video, I'm gonna be talking about exactly how many shares of APXT I am looking to purchase, in particular over the next two to four weeks. Now, I said in my last video when I revealed my full APXT position, because I wanna be as transparent as possible on the channel, and I talk about APXT and its merger of AvPoint a lot, so I thought it was only fair that I actually reveal my full position of exactly how many shares of APXT that I currently own. And it is a long-term investment for me, so the day-to-day -day fluctuations in share price doesn't really matter to me. Um, obviously, it's nice to see it going up, but because I still want to accumulate my position, um, I'm happy when I see red days um, such as today, for example. So in this video, I'm going to be saying exactly how many shares I'm looking to buy over the next few weeks in order to bring my average share price down to sub $14. So I want to get it in that $13 range and then just hold long term. I'm talking two to five years, possibly even longer. So that is the plan for APXT. So I've been doing some calculations today in order to work out how many shares I need to actually purchase in order to get under that sub $14 mark in terms of an average price per share. So currently my average share price in my own personal portfolio is $14.42. Yes, I did purchase 10 more shares of APXT last week as well, which means that, that average share price is slowly trickling down. But I thought I'd do a quick calculation to work out how many shares I actually need to hit my target. Obviously, I'd like to buy more shares, but you've got to pay the bills as well, so I haven't got unlimited amounts of money. So I've got to wait until I get paid next in order to free up some cash in order to purchase these shares. So I thought, how many shares do I actually own based on current share price? And the current share price of APXT is sitting at around $10.40. So I thought if I was to purchase some shares around this price, how many shares would I need to buy in order to get sub $14 average price? So in order to get my share price below $14 per share, I will need to purchase around 120 more shares of APXT at its current share price of around $10.40. This will then give me around 1,130 shares of APXT in my own personal portfolio. Also, we own quite a lot of shares in my partner's personal portfolio, which we're not touching. It's just a set and forget, which I said in my last video. A lot of shares in there and we're just holding them long term, but I do want to average down in my own personal portfolio. So in order to get below $14, I will need to purchase around 120 additional APXT shares at this average share price of $10.40. So is this actually possible over the next two to four weeks? So if we work it out into um, 120 shares of $10.40, it works out around 900 pounds. Now I'm due to get paid next Monday. I'm hoping the share price does stay down by then, in which case I will be able to purchase some more shares. Whether I'll be able to purchase the full 120 shares and get that average share price down um, below 14, all in this month's pay packet, I don't know. It may be a bit tight. Obviously we're just finishing up on our renovation of our first ever buy to let investment property. So that has absorbed a lot of mine and my partner's cash at the moment. But once the renovation costs have stopped and we're not doing any more work to it and it is at a standard which we're happy with, which we've pretty much done to be honest, um, and that monthly cash flow then starts to come in, we should be in a good position. So let me know in the comments down below if you're still looking to purchase more APXT shares and average down on your position, just like I am. I know a lot of you in the last video shared your actual positions, how many shares you had and your average price. Let me know if you're actually looking to buy more or whether you've had enough, you've got your position set and you just wanna see how it goes. As always, if you are new around here and wanna join the investing community, hit that subscribe button. If you appreciate the videos and the content on APXT and the stock market in general, hit that thumbs up button. I really do appreciate the support. Thank you very much for watching and stay safe.